What's up guys, and today we got the legend Frank Gore, 95 overall, bruising back and battle ready chemistry. I do have the chemistry up, so keep that in mind. 5'9", five, uh, five, nine, 91 speed, 92 agility, 94 ball carry, 89 juke, 94 truck, 93 carry, 94 excel, and 80 elusiveness. Does also have a 90 spin and a 91 stiff arm with the chemistry boost of course. And does also have a uh, 68 catch, and I'll talk more about that later as well. Now, of course, the battle-ready chemistry and the ability to break tackles all mixed together is a very nice combination. As you can see here, man, just combining those two together is just going to always be helpful no matter what. And his speed, he can make people uh, you know, miss in the open field, but as you see here, he's, sometimes he will get caught. Now, he only took like maybe two or three hit sticks, like one strip animation. Zero fumbles, but I'd still watch out for that. And the same goes for the uh, catching. Only 68 catch, but all these passes are wide open did not drop a single one he did drop like three that were in traffic even though he did get like hit stick and you know even receivers have trouble catching those but still you know if it's wide open should not be a problem now i did like the stiff form i mean he got some nice animations man over and over and over frank gore was definitely a bit of a surprise i was not really expecting too much but man when i played with him i could not believe how vers versatile he was look at these little bump offs as well and of course these here um the drags you know i got the animations i got the the uh, bump offs and i got these drags so a good stiff arm running back and as you see right there an even better trucking back i mean he was getting once again just like the stiff arm he was getting a lot of animations the same thing goes for the truck he was very impressive when he came to the truck man getting a lot of animations falling forward that play right there made no sense right here i try to truck him again instead i instead i fall forward which is just fine but if you want to truck or stiff arm or just you know use him as a power back in general i say go for it now I definitely think his juking was his lowest uh, grade. He was not bad at it, but he was not he was not as good, you know, compared to everything else he was doing. So I would probably say not lean on that too often. But to my surprise, his highest grade overall was the spin move. Now it was really tough to decide between the spin and the truck because those two grades were his highest. But I guess technically, if I had to choose, I guess the spin is just a teeny tiny bit better. But that's a good thing because if you like to spin, you can definitely do it with Frank Gore and have great success. But if you're more of a trucking, stiff farming type of guy, as you saw him in yourself, he, he can do that as well. So however you want to use him, from what I can tell, Frank Gore is definitely an all-around back. So as you can see, guys, Frank Gore is definitely a very fun back to play with. And in fact, he impressed me so much, I might just pick him up and use him until the... Uh, the Pro Bowl Peterson price uh, price drops because he was really impressive and he, of course he's got the battle ready chemistry and that makes him even more valuable but anyways guys I would definitely say Frank Gore is like a mini Adrian Peterson he can do it all very impressive but anyways guys my next review is going to be the uh, Pro Bowl Derek Johnson hopefully that review comes out today I will be picking the uh, 3D on giveaway winners today as well I will also be dropping a uh, gameplay video I have not done one of those in a while but anyways guys i'll see you boys for the next review don't forget to like comment and subscribe and as always guys thanks for watching i'll see you boys later peace